and good morning. It's the 18th of June 2009 and I am in the village of Penniston in South Yorkshire. We're just north of Sheffield um, and I'd like to introduce you to Alex Jones uh, who is the principal of Penniston Dental Care. Uh, we're going to take a quick look around the practice. So do you want to take us inside Alex? Yeah, and, uh, of let's have a look at the interior of the building uh, which you'll see has been just kitted out absolutely beautifully. Uh, so look for the overall decor but also look at the branding messages that we see as well. And again, the first thing that you see as soon as you come into the building is that, in fact, it's, it's, um, refurb it's been refurbished to a very, very high standard right through the interior of the building. And you'll see also, if you want to look over there, is that wherever there's glass, uh, an attempt has been made to, to do some branding or some messaging uh, through uh, that as well. You can see on the door here, you've got the Penniston logo in the door. And you can also see down at the bottom of the corridor there, you've actually got, not only have you got the Penniston logo in the glass on the door, but underneath, uh, there's a little name badge there. It says sterilisation suite with the Penniston logo. Let's just take a look in the reception and patient lounge. Um, one of the interesting things that they've done throughout the building is that, I think Alex, is it a local photographer? Or yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, so talk to me about all the photographs that are all over the place. Well, we wanted the photographer initially to design the picture which is on the front of the welcome pack, which is keeping out the front of the uh, And part of the deal with that was that we asked him to display some pictures which are all either around here or areas within Yorkshire right. uh, in the practice. And we were only too pleased to do that because he's given us some artwork on the walls and it's also given the pages an opportunity to buy some of the And just talk me around the reception and what's going on here. Yeah, of course. So we've got uh, the patient lounge and an urban plan reception desk with Elizabeth sitting here who's our receptionist. You can see behind Elizabeth the branding on the windows, which uh, Chris discussed outside. Then over here we've got uh, a cappuccino machine, which is uh, is there to make coffee for staff and patients alike. If you can just focus in on the cups, you'll see that we've got uh, practice branding on the cups as well. So that's uh, that's carried through there. Uh, then just some nice comfy chairs, a plasma screen on the wall. There is also a music system. Should we decide that we want the uh, the TV up and just some nice piped music in the, in the reception and then just a, a small collection of magazines, uh, up to date magazines obviously uh, yeah. on the wall. Uh, uh, and I think one thing that I would point out is there's very, very little uh, dental advertising within here. We've tried to keep it as free from that as possible so it's very much more of a, an area of relaxation rather than a hard sell in here. More. I notice you've actually got telephony at reception. Uh, At this minute in time, you, I think I'm right in saying you've got some plans that you may possibly separate. Yes, yeah, that's going to go upstairs and the upstairs in, in time. At this minute in time. All right. So obviously, first impressions: uh, very um, relaxed. It's almost a spa type of atmosphere. Um, <coughs> very nice reception area. All the kind of the trappings that you would expect with uh, concierge class customer service experience. Now, um, just over that way. Uh, is the surgery in which the therapist is yeah, working, uh, but I think Laura's got patients with her at the moment, yeah. so we're not going to be going in there. Um, I've got to show you though, <coughs> again in a bit more detail, um, we've got the door here through to the sterilisation suite, and again we don't need to spend a lot of time in there, but you'll, you'll see that we've got just a very nice clean area uh, in which to work. Uh, it's quite difficult to get a sense of that with a, a camera, but um, you kind of get the drift of what's going on. Let's take a walk upstairs and we'll go and have a look at Alex's surgery and we'll also have a look at some of the areas as well. So if you carry on filming. So um, Alex, do you just want to talk us through what's going, up on, on the, what's going on up on the first Yeah, floor? at this minute in time we have uh, my surgery which is there. We've got a staff and a patient bathroom at the moment uh, due to the layout of the building. We've got a staff room there. We've got the office here which is where Anne works and Rob works when they're doing the uh, Finances, etc. But this is an area that we're considering putting the tele telephony in in the future. Okay. And we've got a, a small room here that at the moment is just almost, you know, it can be a waiting room or a patient lounge for, for patients that are waiting to see me, but probably going to turn that into a consultation suite in the near future. All right, so let's have a look in your surgery because that's yep. um, obviously what all the dentists want to have a quick Oh, not like it. <laughs> Uh, 
Um, and I think the, the first thing I would say about this surgery, which is that the, the, the overwhelming first impression in some respects is actually the aroma in the room. Uh, because what Alex has done is he's got a, the, uh, the good old Morton Brown candle going there in the corner and it does actually just create a very, very nice amb ambience in the room. Uh, but you talk us around the rest of this uh, in St. Lord's Yeah, we're just trying to keep it as clutter free as possible really. So uh, we've got a computer because of the, the, uh, the, all the practices, all the surgeries and the reception area network together. Got an iPod dot there so the patients can choose what music they want to listen to while they're in the chair. Uh, just some copies of the the, uh, the welcome brochure there that we can give out to people should they not have got one for any reason. Uh, and then just a little bit of personal artwork really. Uh, it's something that a lot of patients talk about and uh, you know a lot, a lot of the patients that we have here enjoy winter sports and uh, it's amazing the number of comments we've had and then when they find out the pictures that I've actually taken it just creates a little bit of a talking point. So we, we've got a bit of a snowboarding uh, looks here I think from memory, is that right? Uh, yeah. Um, and uh, I'm also just going to make reference to that Alex has mentioned the uh, the new patient welcome pack here and uh, again just a very very nice job again beautifully branded you're saying the photography is from the, the same guy that yeah the, and there's a lot of stuff in the rest welcome. and then inside um, in the welcome pack we've got a representation of the patient lounge and reception some notes from Alex uh, and then a lot of aspirational stuff about uh, lifestyle, about look good, feel good, that kind of message. So we haven't got teeth and gum material in here, we've got uh, lifestyle material. Uh, and then also a nice portrait of the team at the back and directions. So uh, if anybody books in for a new patient consult, then they're going to receive this through the mail. Uh, and it's obviously going to give them a very good idea of the standard um, of customer service that they're going to uh, receive when they get into the building itself. So very nice clean. Do you want to take us through to that console room? Yep. Yeah. Sure, yeah. Um, we've got certificates on the wall upstairs, so what's happening is that is that anything that's a clinical qualification is on the first floor. Uh, whereas downstairs and what you can see down in the uh, stairwell there is the various certificates that Alex has picked up from courses at St Anne's Dental Clinic as well. So this is your console room Alex? Yeah, this will be a little bit of a work in progress at the moment but yeah. it's a, a nice area room, again evidence of the branding that, you, that you, you mentioned outside, a little bit more literature in here on the various things that we can, uh, we can provide and in time a little workstation here with a, a plasma screen on the wall there and, uh, yeah. and a keyboard so we can highlight the treatments that we do as well. Okay.